If you could choose a job without considering income, what would you choose? Growth in a career is more probable when the job consists of things that motivate you. You won't simply be finishing tasks and not thinking about them, nor waiting for the clock to strike five if you're doing a nine to five job, so you can leave your workplace. It seems like a minor thing, but it plays a vital role in how far you go in your career. Hence, you will be looking for more creative ways to do your job and spot details that you wouldn't have if you didn't put your heart into it. Either comics artist or game designer. I'm in the market of telling stories and both mediums give me a chance to tell a story. One pays more, but is usually a collaborative process. The other traditionally pays less but I can tell exactly the story I want. If I could make a living doing indie works in either, I would. Shelter owner. It is my greatest dream to open an animal shelter for cats and dogs. In my country, there are a lot of stray cats and dogs, which is actually heartbreaking. If I can just take care of them and help them find a forever home and a loving family, that will be amazing. Perhaps a carpenter or ranger in a national park. Working in an office for far too long. But I don't like the way of life. As you grow older, you just want to be close to nature or do some DIY stuff. I believe that going outside or doing manual labor would make me happier. I'd definitely be a professional nap tester. Just imagine getting paid to snooze all day, rating mattresses, pillows, and blankets. I'd be the nap connoisseur, living the dream, or dreaming plus. I'd finally have a valid excuse for all those midday siestas. I would love to do my job. Being an architect city planner, in a smaller scale and without obligation to money givers, but to plan only for the people using it, and I would engage more doing project myself. Building stuff in the city. Pet store definitely. Specifically the exotic fish department. I tell customers the basics what species gets along with each other, how to maintain and enhance their tank environment. I'm just fascinated with the whole hobby. Flight instructor, ship pay, so it's mostly only a starting out job till you get your 1500 hours. But I like teaching and airline flying seems boring even if the planes are cooler. I'd be a professional traveler, I'd explore the world and its diverse cultures and landscapes, capturing the beauty and stories of each location through photography and film. Handyman. I'm handy. I like to tackle small and medium projects, and I like learning new things. I could do everything from open jars to rotate your tires to patch your roof. There's a little bookstore by my house that is fucking amazing. I'd happily work there for the rest of my life if they didn't get paid 14 an hour. Love books. Big Game Hunter. But not a tour guy, which big game hunters generally are, but hunting giant. Ferocious beasts. RPG in real life. Probably a novelist. There's something magical about crafting stories and characters that resonate with people like Got. Firefighter. I don't want anybody to experience having to start from zero because you lost everything to the fire. I feel like I'd like to run a cat sanctuary if I weren't allergic to the little buggers or maybe a historian. Historian. Don't know what range the income can get but I want to experience and learn history firsthand. Work in a music store. Sir amps. Guitars. Maybe learn advanced setup and service guitars as well. Probably a food or travel writer or maybe run a cozy little bookstore with cats and a cafe. I would own a dog rescue. The older I get, the more I'm becoming pro-dog, anti-human, street musician, just to make random people on the street happy with a good performance. Ninja assassin, edit, but will it make me a ninja, or a person that assassinates ninjas? Woodworker, metalworker, blacksmith, any profession that produces anything tangible. I did this, scuba diving, it was amazing, I loved every minute, but it was unpaid. Actually, the lower the income is, the shittier what you do during working is. Curator staff in the theater archives section of the New York Public Library. High school teacher, or maybe middle school. Probably history or English. I think being a dog walker would be pretty cool. Plus I'd be way fitter. Running a bar, 
the stories you would hear would be very interesting. Running a record store. Never open before noon. Never open after eight. Running a cat sanctuary where I just take care of them all day.